True news and the news, man. We back with another one, man. Yeah, John here with you, man. I'm backing you up. Yeah. We back at it, man. So look, we got uh DJ Academics, man. He was doing some capping. We gotta let y'all see this. Let's go right to the clip. Let's go right I don't even want to keep it. I don't even <laughs> play with y'all, man. But listen to this, man, and tell me what y'all think. Big screen that. <laughs> Listen, man. My boy 69 ain't go out like no sucker. That's all I'm gonna tell y'all, man. Listen, the real cannot be spoken on. Um, you know, what I mean, we can't get too federal. You feel me? Just like how Dirk slid for Vaughn, but he kept it low from what I'm hearing. All right, from what I'm hearing. Now I'm being honest. I listen. Being That's the funny thing, and I, <laughs> I, I, I gotta tell six nine this. I'm like, yo, you know, the only way to confirm to that you slid is to go to jail, right? <laughs> That's the only thing I'm gonna say. <laughs> only thing I gotta say is six nine. The only way to confirm that you slid is to go to jail. But for what I'm hearing, six nine sliding, bro. That's all. Now, Bob, uh, when I heard this, <laughs> I was like, yo, that boy nine. <laughs> Standing on business, cuz he let he finna let these chico play with him like that, cuz I, I know Act got the inside information. Act could ain't gonna steer me wrong. That that what I was thinking. We was gonna see a little video pop out where 6ix9ine was getting to the business, like old Treyway 6ix9ine. That's what I thought I was gonna see. Yeah. Same thing that happened to Treyway though. Same thing happened to these dudes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, man. Let, okay, let, let, let's let let I'm gonna share now. Let's show the audience, you feel me? Acting six nines idea slide. <laughs> you with me? Yeah, I'm with you. He All slid. Right. Three suspects arrested in rapper Takashi Six Nines <laughs> attack at South Florida jail. Three men were arrested Thursday in connection with the beating that left rapper Takashi 69 bruised and bloody last week at South Florida Gym. Rafael Medina Jr., 43. Damn. Older nigga. Octavius Medina, 23. And Anthony Maldonado. Oh, he got the young bulls with him at 25. Were arrested Bro. for assaulting and robbing the rapper March 21st at an LA fitness in Lake Worth, according to the Palm Beach Sheriff's Office. Now, before we go any further, I want to send a big apology retraction to Bullets Guzman. Now, we've covered this 6 9 story. We didn't get a lot of views but we do try to give the most accurate version of the facts here and we were operating off of the assumption that bullets guzman was behind the beating because ack told us that was the i'm thinking i'm le talking to the or hearing from the leading source on takashi 69 which is academics he told me it was bullets guzman i went with it i apologize the guys that get picked up don't have shit to do with bullets. Mm. Now we look crazy. Act. We got to hold you accountable, man. What the fuck going on, dog? Like, like who say 10 toes down? Say we got to hold you accountable. Straight up, man. I think 6ix9ine got him on payroll. So it's like, you know, he's like a media publicist for 6ix9ine. So, you know, he got to steer the narrative. You know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah, man, that sounds like it could be possible. We don't really have any evidence that, you know, he's on so the, the payroll. So the dude that was pounding him, he didn't even get charged. The dude who was saying, I want to be famous. That's that, not him. For, for all we know, for all we know, it's one of these dudes. Now, I didn't, now I could admit, I didn't watch the video that closely. I feel like I recognize this guy, though, for sure. But I feel like if bullets had something to do with it, they would have picked his ass up. Takashi right. experienced shit. And it don't even have to be Takashi. <laughs> it could be Palm Beach. Like, what I do know from experience is if you got a victim, right, and there's visible injuries, the state could pick up those charges, even if the victim is not pushing for this. 
So right. I was having fun with it. I was making some little jokes in the opening. But to be fair, we don't know if Takashi really had anything to do with the pressing of a button to get these guys cased up because <laughs> the way that they did it was some sloppy work. They wanted to be famous. They're recording things. Yeah. You're doing it at a L.A. fitness. So consequences come from that. You you play stupid yeah. games, you win stupid prizes. Correct. Yeah. Correct, but we can do say this is six nines history. He don't have no problem with telling them people, okay. <laughs> Once he, you know, to get himself, you know, or to get you booked up, he don't have a problem if you did something to him. Because we seen that with the Treyway, you know, he was mad at those guys for, you know, home invading them and doing whatever they did with him. So, uh, yeah, when it all came to hit the fan, but. You know, it was some other rappers he got into it with that he didn't necessarily get cased up. There was a time where Takashi was, you know, with the business before he went bad. <laughs> I guess if he went bad, he was always bad to some I don't even want to say he was with the business. He had people around him. He was associated around people who was with the business, and he was able to use them accordingly. Yeah, I that, don't that's think, how it is with most yeah. niggas in the streets. <laughs> you know, they ain't gonna be nearly as gangster by themselves as, as they is when they with gang. We know that. Come on now, let's not act like all these niggas. You know, just smartest. You know, some three hundred <laughs> shit. They no, they're no. most people. I ain't gonna say most people, but there is a non-zero portion of gang members that joined the gang because they was too scared to stand on their own. Just some of them, not all. Oh, but there's definitely some of them. Six nine seemed like to me one of those guys, you know. I can see why you would say that. I would see why you could say that. You feel me? Takashi six nines, you know. I don't know. So I'm entertained by him. A lot of shit he say I agree with, but then there's <laughs> certain shit I'm just like, I don't like that. That's not not good. And he, you know, he too much with the promoting violence, man. I feel like he welcomes a lot of this kind of energy. Yeah, and it ain't even his background like that. That's what I'm saying. He's I can't not... say it in his background. The man is from New York. He's from Brooklyn. Brooklyn ain't it? Yeah, I mean, like, what? How is that not his background? <laughs> yeah, but just because you're from Brooklyn, though, I'm saying he got induced. You know, they were trying to use the guy, the good kid, and make him look all weirdo. And try to, but listen, like there are some, there are some people that's that have that story who just are a six nine like it was a good kid in the neighborhood some older guys commissioned you recruited you however you want to yeah. say and, and and it made you feel like you was a part of this thing and promoted you so you could do things in furtherance of the gang gangs right. always prey on people and yeah get them to work for them in one way or another that's that's my perception of it so both sides of that situation was wrong if you ask me yeah. I'm just not surprised by people telling on people anymore. Like, right, it's thing. not. I know it's, it's a fascination a in the anymore. culture, but when I see yeah. that, I, I kind of expect that to happen. You're you know? right. We need yeah. to. We don't need to think that people really want to go to jail. Yeah, people man. don't want to go to jail that bad. Whack 100 yeah. even said that. I wish I could bring up that clip. He said that if he was living in now today's, he would probably be telling too because <laughs> hey, don't nothing happen. He was like, when he was growing up, if you told, you know, people was getting their whole, you know, head chopped off. So it's like now there's no consequence to it. Now so. you can rebrand, rebrand from telling. Like if, <laughs> if if telling is such a big deal, how is Takashi still so popular? Even in the people right. who are just hate watching them. Just like we have some people who come in the comments and they only comment to say negative things. And we were discussing yeah. that the other day. We need them too. If you go watch Neither. it and make the comment every time, that's good for the. Album. I got to get you. I got to hit you too. I need your comment. I need, I that need the hate. Listen, ain't nobody gonna come up without that hate. Believe you me. <laughs> I think that the hate that people have for snitching is still enough to fuel Takashi's career. It's not a. Uh, it's not a cancellation a type that's of situation like some people right. see. Like, oh, this story came out. He telling. Oh, his career is over. Right. I don't the hate think drives him. You mean the hate drives him? Yeah, I, the hate I, drives I agree, him. I, I, I think I Gunner got a chance. You feel me? And look at this, man. When you try to bang on people for whatever reason, we don't know if this was because of the the Puerto Rico thing. It could have been because they see him as a truth teller. Like we have to, you know. They they made mention of that. You know, not in our neighborhood or something like that. <laughs> this is the point I'm trying to make. None of this is stopping the machine. You feel me? All of you people who think that it's over, 
for uh you know gunner or takashi or or terrence gangster williams they're still flourishing <laughs> no. out here you know i don't want to rehash the conversation we no. had that conversation before but this is yeah, another y'all story need to check that out video out on to that. Me, yeah this is another story that proves to me that you know you can make a successful rebound from telling uh when when you try to enforce on tellers this is where you end up these these three stooges <laughs> face ass looking niggas right here man we done got themselves uh in the case you know what I'm saying doing some dumb shit hey man but the streets loved it man they you know what i mean they going down in the streets hall of fame because they? they definitely put the they put their hands and feet on that boy and people really you know clown six nine for this you know what? Boosie need to have... get these niggas a contract. Boosie <laughs> need to bail them out, man. Boosie said that he was raising a, a, a GoFundMe for the other guy. What are they going to do for these guys? Are they going to get the love that Bullet could? It seems like Bullet's got all the clout for it, and now these guys coming out. Are they going to get that love? Are they going to be welcome back as heroes? Y'all chime in in the comments and let me know what's going to happen with these guys. For real, do they have a real. career now. Yeah, for real, for real. The streets do like what they did. You know, they need to drop their services now. That, that that's <laughs> what they that need to be their next move. You a and R's, you 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 managers, you young start, you be yeah. trying to find these niggas right now. Put something on the phone, put something on their books. Just get in there early because mm -hmm. they might have a career ahead of them. Yeah, for real, for real. All right. So, hey man, that's all we got y'all for. Uh, we got for y'all for this video. We are gonna catch y'all on the next one. Make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe. Share to keep the people aware, man. That's all we do. That part. Peace. <laughs>